person having some TSA agent check his pants, his underwear. People's babies' diapers are getting searched. CJ, and then we're going to the calls. Uh, what happens to your brother? Well, like most little people, uh, my brother uses a couple different pieces of uh, equipment to get around because he has mobility issues. And uh, the wheelchair and the walker are uh, kind of immediate uh, alarm for the TSA. And they'll dust him and all of his equipment with uh, bomb detecting, detecting powder or, or liquid, depending on what they have. Sure, sure. What type of little person is your brother? Um, he has a diastrophic dysplasia, so he's quite smaller than someone like Vern Troyer. Uh, really? Yeah, he's extremely small. And, 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 of course, there's probably no history of a little person doing anything criminal like that, but it doesn't matter. You know, yeah. Again, again this, is, this is political correctness. Everyone's treated like a terrorist in America, except the terrorist. Right. To my knowledge, there's never been a little person involved in any terrorist activity in the United States whatsoever. Probably financial, because they're... But, yeah, but exactly. Profiling them, you're not going to see a bunch of little people commandos, you know, Al-Qaeda. No. No, no. I mean, the real Al-Qaeda is being funded by our government. Right. And it, it's not that they're physically violating him but uh you know because he already has to have help to get to the bathroom being of his stature and length of his arms but to have him digging his pants all the time is just embarrassing it's not something anybody of any how old's your age. brother he's only 10 wow but still it's embarrassing we ought to get him in studio sometime when he's down here i'd like to well you're a really nice guy but your brother's a nice guy he is he is but i mean imagine yeah <laughs> Imagine in America they train us to look in our pants. I mean, we're pathetic. Land of the free, home of the brave, what a joke. It's false advertising. Sorry, everybody's got to do it to stay safe. Bull. The people that run the government stage 9-11, they run Al-Qaeda. You know that Saudi Arabians don't have to get searched when they come in. You know that, right? That's mainstream news. They're above the law. I am so sick of this. We, Americans need to start really getting in the face of the TSA, you know, and, and just letting them know, hey, we know, and people, but more than that, the Congress that lets this go on, CJ. Let's go to uh, Mark in Florida. Thanks for holding. We'll go to Chad and others. Go ahead. Thanks for holding, Mark. Uh, what's your take on the open funding of Al-Qaeda? Mass graves now, killing every Christian they get their hands on. This is the liberation of Obama. Well, it's terrible, and I feel real bad for those people, and the globalists have created a terrible situation that there's really no way out of. There's no good options. They screwed up so bad. I mean, if we don't do anything, I mean, you're going to have Iran, you know, Hezbollah. Iraq is going to have to call on Iran, Hezbollah, all the Shiites to try to take out the Sunnis. If we do get involved, they'll just flee to some other country, Syria or Libya, which are now the, the central governments have no power. And who allowed them to regroup? Who, who allowed them to regroup in Libya and, and, and in Syria? Who allowed them to regroup? Well, the Obama administration, they took out Gaddafi. They want to take out uh, Bashar al-Assad. And it's just ridiculous. It's crazy. And there's just no way out of the situation. I'm real depressed about it. I am too, because if our government can get away with this, I mean, does anybody feel safe having a government like this? Well, not at all. And then you have Democrats attacking the, uh, the Bush administration saying, see, look what Bush did. It's all Bush's fault. Well, look, I'm not turning in my guns and I don't support high taxes just because supposedly the Bush administration, you know, attacked Iraq. That doesn't mean I'm going to support the Democrat, the Democratic Party for this nonsense. Oh, but they're I mean, all in it together. The Democratic Party worked with Bush. We were all against that. But I was against the last two wars there. Now my gut tells me. They could high, uh, highway of death all those al-Qaeda forces and save Iraq. But see, they're not. They're going to let the full civil war go. Yeah, I agree. It's crazy. They're doing drone strikes in Yemen, drone strikes in Pakistan, drone strikes everywhere. And I'm not necessarily for that. But then you've got whole convoys of ISIS riding out in the open, 30, 40, 50 cars in a row, and nothing happens. And they're just being allowed to take over Iraq. Oh, it's more, you're a great, you're, you're a great caller, very informed. I've seen some videos that looks like 500 vehicles. It just goes off into the distance. And then Obama's like, uh, 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 I got to go golfing. Uh, 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 uh. And again, that's because it's Saudi Arabia. I am so sick of Saudi Arabian leadership. God bless you. Appreciate the call. Great points. Chad in California, go ahead. You're on the air. Hi, guys. Uh, yeah, we definitely need to just, we, we were saying that we 
to have nothing to do there. We just need to leave and just admit our mistake. We shouldn't have been there like everybody. Like but see, but I agree with you, except this is Western backed. This is an Al Qaeda army. So see, I'm always against what the globalists want. They want open borders, I'm against it. They want gun control, I'm against it. They want to let Al Qaeda run rampant, I want to bomb them. And I'm not saying do that, I'm just saying uh, you, you see my gut response, right? I see it, and then, but I'm also going to comment a little bit that you're not going to like. I, I am definitely a constitutionalist, and I've read the Constitution. And my first thing is, is the United States, and let me finish the whole thought. The United States has no right to say who can or can't come in. Yes, open borders. I'm saying open borders. What the Constitution does allow is the people who come here need to be taxed higher now. Where is everybody? Hold on, hold on, hold on. We can debate. Come back. I gotta go to break. These are hard breaks. Satellite hardened yet. Fifty one after boom, the satellite fires, folks. So I'm gonna come back to you. I, I wanna hear where quote me where it says this in the Constitution. I, I wanna hear this. Clean water at home, clean water at the office, clean water on the go. The Berkey guy has a Berkey water filtration model for anywhere you are and one that fits any budget. Thousands of satisfied customers can't be wrong. For free shipping within the U.S., go to GoBerkey.com or call 877-886-3653. That's 877-886-3653. Helping thousands prepare since 2005, GoBerkey.com. We the people grow cotton, we fabric, engrave ink, embed strips and fibers to protect from counterfeit and carting to a private bank, having it led back at interest, forcing taxes to service debt. This capitalism, or was Jefferson correct when stating a central bank issuing the public currency is a greater menace to the liberties of the people than a standing army? Ted Anderson, I'm placing a free silver dollar in a book that explains our monetary system. Call for your copy, 800-686-2237. It's time to understand the system. Call 800-686-2237. That's 800-686-2237. In the near future. When you realize how fake it all is, the football, the basketball. Security alert. Security alert. This is Homeland Security. Analysis. Infowars building independent media operations. You let the worst people get controlled and tell us that we are the ones responsible. Prime Directive discredit Alex Jones. Jones is the wildly popular conspiracy theory. A popular conspiracy theory talk show called Infowars. Alex Jones is now in an Austin jail. These people are assaulted. Us. Targeting of Patriots engaged. They are never going to stop. They're never going to deviate from their program until we stop them. Block free iPhone app at infowars.com. Block free podcast and video feed. Imperative destroy Prison Planet TV. You gotta set your eye on the enemy, not worry about what propaganda they put out. Intellectually, it's because you can feel it. From hackers and identity thieves to government spies, your online privacy has never been more at risk. Go to unseennow.com and learn how their unparalleled encryption tools can keep your communications totally secure. Unseennow.com offers email, chat, voice and video calling, and cloud storage all for free. It's never been more important to lock down your digital life, and now you can. Stop Big Brother in his tracks. Learn how at unseennow.com. Hey, this is Steve Sanchez. Worried about the Wall Street Casino? Yeah, me too. Wondering when the stock market is going to collapse? You probably want answers, but you know you can't trust the global elite. Well, my good friend Brett Kitchen, best-selling author, has created a DVD set called The Millionaire Black Box, and for a limited time, you get free access. Call 1-800-259-3131. Find out how the global elite invests without having to deal with the global elite themselves. 1-800-259-3131. 1-800-259-3131. Before you slip into unconsciousness The Obama administration, the New York Times like reports, to wants to monitor your smartphone in real time to make sure you're not looking at map aids like Google Maps while you're driving to keep you safe. And the New York Times, of course, misses it on purpose. The whole point is they want to monitor and control the Internet and regulate it in real time, which is how they put the camel's nose under the tent flap. Agency aims to regulate map aids in vehicles. I'm going to do some overdrive callers, so we'll get to all of you that are uh, holding. I'm going to go back to that caller on the Constitution point uh, here in just a second. There are a lot of key articles 
up on InfoWars.com that I hardly ever even talk about. War industry stands to make billions off ISIS threat. Church group ships illegals deeper into U.S. Right now we're posting videos the guy just shot with the church confirming it is illegals they're shipping. So that's confirmed, folks. We're going to have that video added to the Drudge Report linked article. Uh, rampaging jihadists kill dozens in Kenya. Just all part of the it's Saudi Arabian funded as usual. It's lobbyist. Boko Haram in, in, on the western side in Nigeria. They're just everywhere. They're, it's their takeover. Ron Paul says, haven't we done enough damage in Iraq? <laughs> That's the plan. U.S. embassy workers are evacuating the giant embassies so Al-Qaeda can take it over. It's truly mind-blowing. Also, uh, inventing terrorists, new study reveals FBI set up terrorism-related prosecutions. Totally manufactured. That's what RT is reporting. That's up on PrisonPlanet.com and InfoWars.com. And remember, the system doesn't want you here on this show. They don't want you being aware of this information. It's all hiding in plain view now. I have hope we can turn this around. I believe we can. I believe we can. It's just that if we don't, it means curtains for this nation and this world. Uh, briefly, this hour was brought to you by MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex. Great deals on high-quality, non-GMO, storable foods, and a lot of other preparedness items. Check them out today. MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex to find the specials. And they have great customer service. Give them a call, 866-229-0927. MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex. All right, Chad, we're going to go to you and finish up this hour then. Pamela, Skip, Albert, and Jack. Ooh, Jack's in Australia. I hadn't seen that. We'll, we'll go to Jack as well. Uh, Jack, be nimble. Jack, be quick. Jack, jump over the candlestick. Let's go ahead now. And now Jack can call from Australia. That's high tech. Uh, let's talk to Chad in California. All right, make your constitutional point. Where does it say in the Constitution that uh, they anyone that can get here is legal? Well, let me let me finish up my point real fast, and I will go to it. It is Section Nine. Um, basically, the thing that we you pointed out, yes, they're doing it to bankrupt us. Well, we need to stop that part. That's the problem, not the fact that people are coming here. It's the fact that not even citizens should have a social welfare system set up. This needs to be abolished. This is what people are upset about. Don't give people anything to come here. Work hard. Do your thing. Make the payment. Well, I mean, it's true. I mean, I mean, it's like going out and feeding the deer in your backyard. Soon they'll be a lot more deer than there should be, and then they'll all be starving to death, and you'll be feeding them 100 pounds a week uh, of, 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 of deer feed. It's, it's the same deal, but we're way past that now. The whole world is collapsing right now financially. The population is doubling in the third world. They all want to come here. We cannot allow that to happen at this point because they're using the loophole in the socialism. Now, tell me what's in Article 9. Uh, the migration or uh, importation of such persons as of the United States now ex uh, existing shall think proper or to omit shall be prohibited by Congress prior to the year of 18, basically 1880. Um, but a tax duty put on persons, uh, let's see, a tax or duty may be imposed on the importation not exceeding $10 for a person. Basically, everything is a monetary thing. Yes, you're supposed no, to... No, no, I, I understand all that, but that's from like 1898. Or excuse me, 1798. You are listening to GCN. I mean, Obama's GCN not supposed to head up the UN Security today. Council. He does. Article 1, Section 9. We'll be right back in overdrive. In the near future. When you realize how fake it all is, the football, the basketball... Mm -hmm. Security alert. This is Homeland Security. Analysis. InfoWars building independent media operations. We let the worst people get controlled and tell us that we are the ones responsible. Prime Directive discredit Alex Jones. Jones is the wildly popular conspiracy theorist. It's a popular conspiracy theory talk show called InfoWars. Alex Jones is now in an Austin jail. These people are assaulting us. Targeting of patriots engaged. They are never going to stop. They're never going to deviate from their program until we stop them. Block free iPhone app at InfoWars.com.
Block free podcast and video feed. Imperative. Destroy Prison Planet TV. You gotta set your eye on the enemy, not worry about what propaganda they put out. Intellectually, it's because you can feel it.